unboxing. So right now we're gonna really start off with the 16 Pro Max. Also, if you see me talk to myself, I'm very schizophrenic. iPhone 16 Pro Max. Oh my God, it feels so nice. Oh, oh yeah, that that just feels really good. Oh, oh, yes. Garbage, you get away. Any second now. Oh, we got the desert titanium look for those curious. It does look very appealing to the eye. In my personal opinion, at least it does. Definitely not some of the best lighting right now that I could have found, unfortunately. So unfortunately, my microphone ended up dying. None of what I say got recorded. Quite heartbreaking, I know. Maybe not for you because I am definitely a talker, yapper, PhD and such. Anyways, the iPhone 16 Pro Max, Desert Titanium. The coloring looks a little bit off. I mean, not gonna lie to you, as I'm recording my voice over here, I'm taking a look at the phone and it eh, kind of a few times remind me of white, not gonna lie to you. I know it's not white. You don't need to school me in the comment section. I feel you. I absolutely agree. In fact, it's not white. Just could have been a bit more deserty, if that makes any sense. Hell yes. Six year old grammar. You love to see it. Aside from that, the bezels definitely are a little bit thinner. I could tell that. The size difference between the Pro Max, the 15 Pro Max, and the 16 Pro Max, you can't really tell. You can't entirely tell. Aside from all that, the screen, it's bright, it's beautiful. That's to be, you know, something expected. The sides are just stunning as well. The camera button works phenomenally as well. I don't know if I have a clip of that in here. Um, I don't think I do, but I will be doing a completely separate iPhone 16 Pro Max review video. So subscribe or stay tuned for that, my beautiful little pups. Aside from all that, I don't know why I called you puppy. The cable. The cable I did notice is a little bit long. I'm a big fan of that. Okay, huge fan of that, in fact. I don't like the super short cables that sometimes they give. It's a little bit annoying. Aside from that, obviously no stickers. I'm not really against the whole no stickers thing. It's actually pretty good for the environment, you know what I mean? Aside from all that, let's move on to the AirPod 4s. Got the noise cancellation edition over here. I will be reviewing them with the AirPod Pros 2 just to see which one's better. I think they both are most likely going to be Good in their own ways. I already listened to the fours, not gonna lie to you. I prefer silicone tips right off the bat. I'm gonna let you know. But these are very comfortable. Very, very, my little beautiful human beings watching this video, aside from all that, designed by Apple in California. Yay! I live in LA. Aside from all that, let's take a look. I forgot to see if they gave us stickers in there. I don't know. I'm not really that much of a big sticker person. The little paper they put around these AirPods, I'm not going to lie to you, this year? I don't know, man. I don't know what they did, man. It just seems a little bit different. It seems a little bit stronger. You don't get a charging case, surprisingly. AirPod 4s do not come with a charging case. I do not know why. Um, did they highlight that even in the little presentations that they got? I do not know if they did. They did not include cable, though. So right from that, it's all good. We have a bunch of cables at home. It's not really a big problem. The size is phenomenally small. I love the size that these guys really do come with. Just because the big bulky ones, they're not big, they're not really bulky, but it's like, <sighs> you don't really want that in your pocket. You know what I mean? I kind of like the little small thing over here that you got on the left. I prefer it. Yes, it's a little bit easier to lose, but heck, people were losing the bigger ones regardless anyways. You know you were doing that. You know you're watching this video thinking, maybe I should just get um, new ones because I lost my old ones. I know what you did, Bubba. Aside from all that, here's the opening of it. I do love the fact that it comes with speakers. You can hear it when it's connecting. You can hear it when it closes. I think these small little details are very nice. The actual stem... How do I explain it? Again, I prefer the silicone tips. But holding these at the first glance and even feeling them now, putting them in my ears, they're very comfortable. And how do I really explain this by comfort? It's, it's very satisfying putting these things on. Now, additionally, I did want to do a size comparison between the AirPod Pro 2s and the AirPod 4s. I don't think on camera you really be able to see size difference. It's more so the geometry, if one could say, when it comes down to differences. Of course, the silicone tip will 
play a little bit of a role here. But overall, I'm not going to lie to you, even the size difference, it's very, very minimal. So if you're coming from the Pro 2s and you want to get these ones for whatever reason, you're not really going to notice that much of a difference when it comes down to sizing. The only real main difference that you will be noticing is, once again, obviously, everyone knows this, it's the silicone tips. I prefer the silicone tips. I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit upset that these guys don't come with some form of optional silicone tips. Maybe a third party does, but it's really not that big. You want the silicone tips, get the pros. I'm talking about comfort here. I still need to actually give them a proper test. Both devices, by the way, both the AirPod 4s and the iPhone 16 Pro Max. That's something I'm actually seriously looking forward to. I want to see how they perform. I want to see is the battery better, okay? Because there's a few things from the 15 Pro Max I did not like. It overheated way too much, and I felt like the battery died much faster than my old 13 Pro Max, which was exceptionally disappointing. I want to see improvements here. I seriously do. And the AirPod 4s, I'm not a fan of silicone tips. I am a fan of silicone tips. I'm sorry. And I want to see if these change my mind. Anyways, subscribe, stay beautiful, and do me a favor, okay? Drink your, drink your water. I know you did not drink any water today, Bubba. I know you didn't. Go grab that glass of water. Go grab that bottle and hydrate.